Now, the national government and what the PNG has jointly funded the Yangru Town Water Supply at the cost of 6 million kina. And Yangru South has become the first in Papua New Guinea where the plant water treatment plant has been installed. Project engineer Rachel Ivai told MTV News the system was tested last year and operating well. The project consists of two submersible pumps from the source behind us, Hambelia. We have a raw water tank, 45,000 kiloliters, a packaged water treatment plant, and a one megaliter reservoir, storage, storage for treated water. The packaged water treatment plant, which I can proudly say is the first installation within the country. Local MP Richard Maru says water and sanitation is important in health and Younger Associates plan is to promote hygiene and good health practice within the communities. And other projects. Without water, as we all know, uh, people cannot live. Life will be very unpleasant and this town will never grow and develop. This is a very necessary project that will provide a co-infrastructure to uh, bring the mobile barracks and other projects into the district, including our new district headquarters. 96 wards in the electorate will benefit after 40 years of struggle. The national government was thanked for investing in a healthy concept that promotes clean, safe water. We are putting in septic tanks as well, because we know the water supply is coming through. And um, one day soon, I believe, under the current leadership of uh, Honorable Richard Maru, an amazing leader we have for, the, for this part of the country. I know that we are going to have a security system as well. Now, after positive outcomes from the awareness conducted, what the PNG's focus now is to connect water to all houses. And this project is expected to be completed by April this year. In Wiwek, East Sipik province, Fabian Hakalitz, National MTV News.